You're watching Let's Chat. It is never a bad idea to go ahead and get a good idea about what to wear, especially in the professional world, in the world of success. Dr. Robin Stearns is here with Dress for Success Chattanooga to tell us all about these awesome outfits, first of all, that you guys have on this morning, but about an interesting event coming up as well. So thank you for making the time to be here. Thank you for having us. We appreciate it. So in addition to this, you have Rakesia Grant and mm -hmm. Savannah Frazier as your models today, and they're yes. not only just rocking some great looks, but they are Dress for Success. So <laughs> remind me, what's services does Dress for Success Chattanooga provide? So our mission at Dress for Success is to ensure that women receive economic independence and we do that by providing wardrobe and career support and also a network of support. I love that. So obviously people nowadays do it. Ch styles change, but there's something that always stays consistent and that yes. is business casual, professional wardrobe, mm -hmm. and really how you want to present yourself to the public and especially to a future employer. So remind me, obviously you brought the couple of models today to yes. demonstrate some professional looking attire. Will you, will you break down each of their outfits and tell us how you chose those pieces? Okay, what Savannah has on the classic navy suit. Love it. And we added a pop of color underneath with a nice nude heel. And so that can also be dressed up and dressed down. So she can also take off the jacket if she goes to a more casual setting for work. And she can take it off and just wear the shirt and the pants I love with it. some nice flats. That is awesome. And I mean, obviously, is there like a heel size that you prefer? There, I think that's in general, like maybe a. I don't know what type of style I'm trying to look well, for. Well, <laughs> in this day and age, flats are preferred. Yeah. Mostly because a lot of people are not sedentary. Gotcha. They're walking around. And then we're also dealing with the at-home work, too. Yeah. So some people have on pajama bottoms. Hey, there you <laughs> go. Talk to the work from home and it's just the top <laughs> yes. up, but you look, exactly. still look very professional. Remind Correct. me of, about, tell me about Rikisha's outfit okay, as well. Okay, so Rikisha has on uh, another classic black suit, which goes a long way. We had another pop of color just to do a little individuality. Yeah. She has on a nice set of pearls because pearls are classic. Absolutely. And she also has on a small heel as well. That yeah. is awesome. Yes. I love it. And I do love that you brought in the elements of pattern and color because just yes. because, and like you as well, you are all rocking all the patterns and color you. because just because it's business, professional, or casual doesn't mean that it means boring. You know, and you can look very professional, but you can also have fun with your wardrobe, which I love. So tell me about what is the process for being referred to for Dress for Success? So we work with community partners. And so we ask them to refer the clients that they work with. We only work with women. Gotcha. And so once they refer them, they come to our boutique, which is very nicely set up. And then we stay with them for 15 months at least. So they get um, things to wear to work. They also get resume building and also mock interviews. So we prepare them for the workforce. That is amazing. Tell mm -hmm. me again how about the Celebrate Her event that you have coming up and how these funds will be raised to benefit women in our community. So our Celebrate Her it is our first fundraiser and fashion show. It will be on October 24th. The doors will open at 6.30 p.m. And for $250, you can support one woman for 15 months. And that's going to help our clients get the tools that they need to be successful in the workforce. That is awesome. Tell me about, again, before we move on from these, about the pieces. Where do you shop from? Is it there like a budget, price range that you kind of try to shoot for and certain brands that you like to work with? No, we accept donations from the public. Okay. The public really helps us. So anyone who can partner with us and have anywhere from casual to business attire, anywhere from scrubs, yeah. that helps because we dress them from head to toe. They get undergarments, something to wear, accessories, and a purse. I love that. And yes, so the, obviously, like when you, I like that you said nursing and like the scrubs for it, because this extends to all different industries. It's it not does. just clerical work. It's Correct. obviously going to go into the nur in the healthcare industry and mm -hmm. that as well. How can someone get involved and support Celebrate Her? They can find us on all of our social media platforms at Dress for Success Chattanooga. So we're on Facebook, LinkedIn, and IG. That is awesome. Mm -hmm. And how can individuals donate to Dress for Success Chattanooga just in general as well? Go to our website and then give us a phone call and we'll be there and we'll take them. They bring them directly to the boutique and then we sift through them. We do ask that all items are clean because we don't have the capability to clean them at the boutique. Gotcha. Well, y'all are awesome. Thank you so much for making the time to be here this morning and telling Thank us you. how to dress for success. These are amazing outfits and I'm I had to get a picture before you guys leave just just for Thank outfit you. inspiration is there a phone number or a website that people can visit as well so just dress for success chattanooga gotcha mm -hmm. awesome well thank you guys so much for making the time to be here we'll be right back with more let's chat right after this